happy new year to everybody. It's been a long time since I've done a vlog, a monthly vlogs. Um, I don't know, life was just busy, living in the moment, just still wasn't in the mood. I'm not gonna force it, you know? So, but I'm excited to get back into it. I'm gonna try to be consistent as I can. I'm not gonna pressure myself because I feel like that's where, you know, I tend to fall off. But I just came back from the dentist. My face probably looks a little bit swollen here. Um, last week I had to take out my wisdom teeth, which was horrific. Okay, I've been avoiding this procedure for about 10 years and um, me going last week proved why because it was stupid. I'm still in pain. I just went to do my like, you know, follow up, see how it's healing and stuff like that. But yeah, it was not good. Um, still eating on one side of my mouth. Like there's just a lot. So yeah today is january 6 is 12 49 p.m and tonight i'm heading to my godmother's house uh so my godbrothers and sisters are gonna be there like family friends and stuff like that um we're going for a game night so hopefully i remember to take out my phone and you know capture that and then tomorrow my friend jamil has her gender reveal she got married um november um, I didn't get to show that. I was just in the moment, just enjoying the time. But yeah, so her gender reveals tomorrow, and um, then getting ready to go back to work. So most of my break was literally me sitting in my bed with a puffy face and crying because I'm in pain. That's pretty much it. But you know, we move. Got to do, got to do, um, and yeah. Okay, so I was wearing um, this outfit, like this two-piece outfit that I have. And I'm like, okay, this is like cozy, like it's just chill. I told Shannon, she's like, mm, dressing up. I was like, that's not what I was going for. So let's think about something else to wear. And then I was gonna wear this other two-piece outfit. And then I called my god sister. I'm like, hey, what are you wearing? Cause Shanta's wearing something that's more dressed down, showing your gravity. Like, is everyone doing that? Or is it like, is it a mixture of vibes with lounge sets and graphic tees and, you know, sweats? And she's wearing sweats. So I'm like, I will be doing the most if I wear this as well. So I'm going to change. So I changed it again. And yeah, so here we are. Um, changed so much that I'm wearing slides. Because what the F, I don't care anymore. So when I get there, have some fun. I'm very tired. You guys know, I talked about the dentist, it's very stupid. And my mouth is feeling okay right now. I brought my painkiller in my pocket. One painkiller, you know, in my pocket. So that I can take it just in case. My mouth has to act up later. But hopefully I remember to take on my phone so I can actually record a little bit of the game night. So you can see some of the people in my life that probably you've never seen before. So, yeah. My name's Emma Chef. Guys, please. She's so irritating. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so they're born to John B's album, even the songs that didn't. Okay. Play. One's on the end. Um, then Sean, then, then who? Ella DeBarge. He has more tracks than John B. Of course, he's a different artist. <laughs> but that's where I see. All right, let's just play the thing. Yeah, that's right. So, uh, track. So, uh, so, uh, so, so, I was using the most example. So, I was using the most example. I was born to the band. I was born to the band. Oh, 
Everybody's ready? Yeah. Stress yeah. so, it all. Stress it all. Who's doing the countdown? Lisa, look out. Count. 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 So on one, I'm going to count down from three to one, okay? No. Hold on, maybe do it to ten. My ten? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm nervous. Hold on. From five. Okay, so I'll count from ten to one, okay? okay. Show me, show me. On one, we pop. Ten. Nine. Eight. This is January 9th. I don't know the time. I think it's after 11. I don't know. Um, and so yesterday I was out with my friend Shaquille. Um, you guys have probably seen her before in one of my vlogs at some point. Um, and then today was my first day back to work. And actually work itself was not bad. Like I wasn't as tired. I think it's the after work things that I had to do that mashed me down. I've been cooking and prepping food for about five hours, four hours. My feet are hurting me. Um, Just, just a lot, just a lot. And just planning and not planning, but like preparing myself for the next day. Like I'm, I'm done. I'm so tired. So. So I wanted to check in. Um, this week I don't have much going on. I'm gonna go get my passport taken care of this week. I hope that's not annoying, but we'll see. And what else do I have going on? Oh, my goddaughter's coming over on the weekend. One of my goddaughters coming over on the weekend. Um, to spend a little bit of time, and then that's pretty much it. I am trying to wrap my mind around getting my report cards together now. And yeah, so I'm super just tired of lots of things I didn't want to do and accomplish. But I don't know if I have like the, I'm not young like I used to be. I don't have the energy. Like my energy level is not the greatest. So I don't know. I just wanted to check in and just see how my first day back went um, since the uh, the new year. So yeah, bye. <laughs> This was a day I just took some time to get work done. I had so many things to do, report cards, lesson plans. It was literally nonstop all day, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Hey guys, happy Saturday. You guys cannot even see me. What? Happy Saturday. Um, it is, I think 7.50 in the morning um and i'm gonna do laundry i am looking forward to this weekend it's just gonna be fun just really need this weekend um and yeah so i have i'm going out with Chacal tomorrow um to do some like, wedding stuff whatever and then monday should be a pretty chill day which i'm looking forward to so i'm gonna do some laundry do a little facial or something today. Shave. Get my life together. You know what I mean? I usually like, I don't know if you guys know, but like, um, like V and like near like those hair removal things. I try to do them like maybe max four, three, four times a year. And then I just like razor it up my body. That's too much information, but razor just to maintain, you know, like so that you're always fresh and so clean. Because like I remember when I was younger. I would only really like, you know, like go off from like, yeah, I'm gonna be sh summertime, always summertime. But like, honestly, like just keep yourself together, no matter the no matter the season. Just try to maintain it. it helps with your mental, helps you feel good about yourself. So I'm gonna do a little facial and stuff today. Um, moisturize my hair, maybe take a bath 
instead of like an actual shower. Um, yeah, clean up my space, prepare my food for the week, like just use this day as like a refresher, like a restart. Um, do a couple things for work if I have energy or time, but like I'm not going to push it. Um, yeah, that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing today. So I'll try my best to remember to take my take you guys along with me in terms of what I'm doing today and this weekend. I will try. I'm not great at it. But uh, I'm trying to get back in the swing of like vlogging and stuff like that. So yeah, hey guys, they say I'm in my laundry room here. I'm going to just wash my um, bath mats and my bath towels. So yeah, I'm going to take care of that and then get my smoothie together because I'm going to eat. Hey guys, so I'm here making my breakfast and meal prepping. It is 1044. And yeah, I'm trying to do this holding this in my hand. But making my eggs now. I have my smoothie already. And I have my tea or my hot water boiling. I made my asparagus and stuff for the week. And I made some stew chicken and fried chicken to have for the week. So I'll have maybe what? I didn't fried chicken. I made curry chicken and um, stew chicken to have for the week. So I'll show you guys. It's still cooking, but I'll show you guys how it looks. So then. Ignore the dry hands. This is my stew chicken here. And then my curry chicken there, but it's not done. Yeah, so that's what I'm doing. And then hopefully by like 12, I can finish up my laundry and then start my little self care. So that is the deal. So let's try to keep you guys in the loop of what's happening today. And I'll show you guys my little eggs that I made. Cook them up and then I'm gonna make some peppermint tea or mint tea to eat with it or to drink with it. What? Yeah. Hey guys, so just a little check in here. It looks so dark in my room, but my windows and my blinds are still closed. My curtains still closed. I have my lamp on. That's it. Just calm and zen. I'm playing my John B. Turned it down, you know, copyright. Um, and just putting away some clothes. I don't have a lot to put away. I have one more load that's in the wash machine. It's like one o'clock right now. Yeah, one something. Um, and then I can officially start my self care. Um, do my hair and take a nice little bath and all that stuff. Looking forward to that. Might even read a book today. Who knows? Who knows? You never know what the day will take. Yeah. But I like the fact that I can just like, you know, my space is clean that helps my mind a lot like my space has to be clean so i feel calm and at ease and things like that keep things organized um i look at an idea of something else i could do probably organize my desk drawer that's like she needs to be happy there right now but i'm gonna do the most don't pile it up and just give myself extra work so and everything is tidy clean wiped down all that stuff so just putting these clothes away and yeah, take a nice shower or bath, whatever I decide, light my candles, and it's cool, maybe watch some movies or something, I don't know, but like literally just take it easy, like just chill. So I'm looking forward to the rest of my day, I'm enjoying my day, like this, honestly, when you hit a certain age, not that I'm old, because I'm not, um, but it's just like when you get to like your 30s, like you appreciate the downtime because life is so busy, especially in your 20s, you're so busy building life and trying, I'm still building, you know, I'm trying to get things together, but I'm at a different stage in my building. And that stage in your 20s is exhausting. And even though like it doesn't feel so bad, like you look back, you're like, what, I, what was I doing? All working four jobs, guys, at one time, four jobs at one time. Okay, one full time and three part time. So just doing all these things, you know, and trying to like get your life together, it's a lot, it's a lot. So now that I'm in this stage of continuing to build, but in a different way, um, yeah, these days of like just getting the little things around your house together and stuff like that is so rewarding and relaxing and you can kind of sit and enjoy what you worked for and what you're working towards. So yeah, I appreciate all this time that I'm getting grateful um for that so yeah that's pretty much it hey guys how's it going I'm trying to keep myself in the vlogging for today 
I started to slow down, I'm not gonna lie, I was like, had so much energy this morning, and then after a while, I'm like, okay, I'm getting tired. So I don't know if it's like three something now, and I'm just, I do my facial, my face mask, and then I'm going to take a bath, I think I'm gonna do the bath, and then whatever I feel to do afterwards. Um, but yeah, this is my face mask. I have this from this company that used to be around called White Leaf. Um, it's like a face mask I had from them. Uh, they're not in business anymore, but I still have some stuff and they work really well. And so I dabble in it every now and then. Um, but yeah, my go-to like facial products is Indie Beauty. Love her stuff. Um, I'll wear her Instagram somewhere here so you guys can check it out but her stuff is amazing my skin flourishes she has so many things not just like for skincare necessarily like i remember one time she's even selling like drinks and stuff like she's amazing um just like overall wellness and stuff and different types of soaps for different types of things like she's really good so um yeah this is definitely crumpling up so let me stop talking so it can set properly and i will see you guys soon bye so i am done kendall is lit there um got through my day to my face thing cleaned up just really chilled dream room company today it was nice um and yeah and i'm gonna go to my bed it's like six something go to my bed and watch some movies and just chill really I have dinner in probably like an hour and a half or so and then call it a night and get ready to go out with Del tomorrow which I'm so excited about so trying to figure out what I'm gonna wear we're gonna check out this new restaurant called Miss Local Moors um so I'm looking forward to that because we've been talking about that for a while so we're gonna go tomorrow and yeah I'm just like I find an outfit I'll brainstorm that while I'm in my bed because we want me don't know we want me don't so yeah bye guys morning guys happy sunday um just finished washing my face um and i'm gonna take down my hair to see how it looks i'm not sure so this should be interesting um but yeah my skin honestly my skin routine is just simple and it works and yeah so i'm gonna get ready try to stop my hair then i'll go do my makeup and then throw in some clothes not throw on find an outfit dresses Adele is in there say hi Auntie Larry hi. we're looking for some dresses and stuff for Adele because wedding day is coming up so it's fun trying on tons of stuff she gets ready so fast and when we're saying like if it was us two dresses in like all two hours because it's a lot of dress a lot of up and down zipper this and that so yeah so we're trying on some stuff and see what she comes up with so so we can show you this one. The sparkly one before? Yeah. Yeah. yeah that dress. Sick, something like that. If I had that, if I had that, um, image for my ceremony yeah. but I don't I want I, I still want that same this is the other one similar for us okay hey guys so I'm back home I 
I don't think I did too bad today with taking you guys around with me because, you know, you guys saw the bridal shop and stuff like that. But I went to Miss Lookamore's. I filmed the entrance and that was it. What? Can I show you guys what I'm eating? Can I show you? I didn't really have anything crazy because I can't. I am watching what I'm eating. But um, it was so nice in there. The ambiance was nice. Vibe was nice. Food was good. I had jerk chicken, coleslaw. Um, I didn't get anything special to drink. But apparently the drinks there are really nice um Shaquille and Auntie Lori got like some like punch or something like that but I was like a too much sugar for me too much alcohol for me I'm trying to really like you know be mindful when I'm going out so didn't do the most but what I had was really good so yeah I'm definitely gonna go back there um and try it out but I'll probably show put my reel in here somewhere so you guys can see what didn't show anything you know um but yeah back home now i love this look and if you guys can see the whole vibe that i went for super cute it's like a two-piece set and i had boots i need white boots to go with this outfit or like some tan boots like i feel like i was, was giving like oh 2023 at the top and then 2009 on my shoes <laughs> like what so yeah this is the outfit Ooh, almost fell over outfit that i wore today and then my hair actually worked out like i'm hoping i can keep this for the week i don't know how long i'll be able to maintain this but i love maybe what i'll do is i'll probably twist it tonight i don't know how to keep this i've never done it before so i'll probably twist it tonight and see if it will last me through the week and just like touch up the front and stuff like that um for the week but it looks really good right guys mm -hmm. and the makeup is popping baby so i'm gonna and this part of the vlog here and i will see you guys at some point this week maybe um we'll see because there's not really much going on at work go to the gym come home or we can go home so there's not really much that happens in my week to show you but um i'll try my best to take you guys along if there is something to take you along to and if not then i'll be back to end the vlog so bye guys it is what time is it it is 8:45 p.m. January 22nd. Bye guys. Hey guys, happy Friday. It is the 27th of January. It is 6.03 p.m. I am about to do my vision board. I, I literally do not remember. I was just sitting in my bed and I was watching um, BMF and BS watch BMF. And I was like, I got a notification on my thing, a reminder for me to actually do my vision board. So like I can, you know, so I'm going to do that right now, which I'm excited about because I didn't, you know, remember. So I don't have, I have, actually no, I'm going to say I don't have too much work to do, but I do. I have a lot of work to do. And I wanted to like go out tomorrow, but and like hang out with friends, but I, depends how much I have, a lot of marking. I got to wash my hair and redo it um for work next week and then i have another bridal appointment with shaquille on sunday so it looks like it's gonna be tonight and tomorrow like just like getting my life together so yeah i want to get this vision board done something enjoyable and fun and just you know something to look forward to and yeah just chill out but i'm gonna close my vlog here hope you guys enjoyed following along with me this month um went to my godmother's house for a game night I was with Shaquille most of the time with doing like um wedding stuff um Jamil's gender reveal so it was a little fun stuff with family and friends I'm looking forward to February um I have a lot of things I'm looking forward to doing and just spending time with people like it's just I'm loving my people just loving spending time with them so um having D over next month going with Shoshana like going out to a little lounge so it's gonna be fun next month I'm looking forward to that so I'm going to close the vlog here. Bye, guys. Drop the roof and let the smoke clear. I got diamonds doing just these slides in both ears. Dice rolling on the Las Vegas trip tonight. Slip that on and we might miss the fight. Fuck or not, I keep the quality in my shorty bag. No, she want a mom when she tattooed that ass. I'm a lover boy. She got a toy. Aw, this is the dorps. Thank you. Oh. Do you want everybody on the most? Yes. Thank you.
We are doing a little bit of wedding day shopping in Dallas. Um, I don't know. 4.30. And um, we're talking about how fast. I seen this last time. She is very fast at changing. I take 8,000 years to do one dress. So I think she did maybe like six dresses and it's been like maybe 30 minutes. So yeah, Speedy Gonzalez. How are you feeling, Jess? I love this. I love it's, this me, it's me putting the camera in her face, you know. I love this experience. I know, it's really nice. It's a really, really nice room and stuff. So, yeah, it's exciting. Hey, Lily. Are you doing? Oh, I vlogged you. Yeah. Hey, it's Auntie Lily, guys, man. Yeah, so we are. This is our last one for the month, so we'll see. Hopefully, we find what we're looking for today. Last week was nice, but hopefully, this is the, this is the one uh, today. So I'm going to close the vlog here. Bye, guys.